Hey everybody, hi, welcome. Thanks so much for joining me and my first sidekicks for it's another video. So happy you're here. Hope you stick around, hit that subscribe, hang out with us. We do subscription box unboxing, shopping hauls after the day, and so much more. So we do hope you stick around. If you're new, I'm Laura. This little brown puppy dog is Xena, and Wyatt is the white puppy dog. For today, I have an Amazon Prime wardrobe for you. Um, Amazon Prime wardrobe is through your Amazon Prime membership. It is, it was $4.99 a month, but I'm remembering that my price just went up. Not a lot. Um, I'll confirm the price for you down below. I want to say now it's something like $7. Um, that is a monthly fee. It renews monthly unless you stop it. Um, and I do, and the reason for that is it covers your styling fee basically. So I use a stylist. You do not have to use a stylist to, to use Amazon Prime Wardrobe. You can shop yourself. Um, however, I choose to use a stylist and that's what that uh, fee is for. Um, you get with the Prime Wardrobe, seven items, up to seven, I believe it is, items that you can have sent to your home to try on for, I believe it's seven days. You keep what you love and pay for it and send back what you don't. Um, and I have a collection here of dresses and jackets, starting with the dress I have on right now that we're going to run through. You can give your stylist notes um, asking for specific items. I said fall transition, easy wear comfy outfits that go from virtual work meetings to weekend wear. So that was my direction. Um, and I think we have some fun pieces here. So I'm excited to dig right in. Let's do it. First outfit. Um, this is a dress by Splendid. And it is a sweater dress. But it feels um, more like a sweatshirt dress, to be honest. It has this fun little ruching, de ruching detail kind of going diagonally down the front. So it starts, let's see, it starts kind of over here. So over here under the armpit and kind of goes directly down um, to the front of my knee. And I think that allows it to be much, much more forgiving. So I really love that about the dress. I also like that it's kind of this black wash and not a solid black which also allows it to be a little bit more forgiving on the body. Um, I like the length, and you can play with that a little bit with this ruching, so you can make it a little bit longer if you wanted, you can make it a little bit shorter if you wanted, but perfect at right above the knee. It is long sleeve as we're going into the colder months. This would be great for fall or winter. Add some high boots if you wanted to once the colder weather comes, add tights. I'm really liking this dress. Um, here's what it looks like from the side. In the back. I really like it. Here's a closer look. I think this ruching is really kind of interesting. It does have the seaming detail and it kind of does stick out a little bit. Um, just so hopefully you guys can kind of see that in the sun a little bit. So you could dress this up for work. Um, put it on, put on heels, put on a blazer. We're going to try um, try a jacket on with this, but you could go blazer, you could go weekend, you could put tennis shoes on. I feel like you could do a lot with this. This is called the Splendid Women's Sweater Dress in Black. Um, $86.88 is the price. And I am going to add this pale pink BB Dakota Moto on top of it because I think these color combos would be adorable. This would be more of a date night or weekend look. Love the color of this, kind of a dusty pink. Let's see what it looks like. Zipped up, if I can get it. That's cute. Leave it open, you could leave it zipped. Here's a closer look. Does not have zippers on the sleeves. It is in this faux leather. Pockets on the side that zip. I do like this color with the dress. And this one is called 
the BB Dakota Women's Moto Finish Textured Vegan Leather Jacket in Rose Quartz 7412. And I do have movement in this. I think this is a pretty jacket. I like it. All right, let's do another outfit. Okay, so next up I have this amazing trench. Look how pretty this jacket is. Loving this leopard. This is amazing. However, I will tell you that this jacket is fairly stiff. So I'm not loving that part of it. Look how pretty this is. I really like it. I just wish it was a little more relaxed. It's very stiff. And I didn't get a tag for this one, so I don't know why. Um, I'll put the link to it down below, but I don't have a price for it. Everything came in three different bags. And I didn't get a price for, or a tag for this one to tell me how much it was. So I paired it over top of, well, first of all, let me say, this is what it looks like open. Flat pockets here. So I really like it. I just don't think I would probably keep it because it's a little too stiff for me, but I love the idea of it. I think if it was relaxed, I would definitely keep it love. And this one was by Baby Dakota. No, this one is a daily ritual. So probably, let's see if it says the price on the tag. This would actually be a really good price. Their daily ritual brands are priced so nicely. Um, but that, yeah, I'll put it down below. Okay, and then let's talk about this dress. So this is by BB Dakota. This is called the Steve Madden Knit Dress in Black, 6886. This dress is super comfortable, lots of stretch, has this ruching down the center, um, very, like, lots of stretch. So you could make this longer, you can make it shorter, you can put this ruching wherever you want it, um, highs, bumps, and bumps. It kind of has, since the ruching is here in the center, it just causes that little bit um, to come up in the middle, but not in a bad way. Here's a closer look. And this is a knit dress, so it just feels so comfortable on. And this is another one that you could dress up or dress down. So comfortable. I'm going to try on another jacket I, that they sent me with it. This one is by Tommy Hilfiger. This one is a faux suede, very relaxed, unlike the trench, very relaxed. Love this tan, comfy, cozy suede. This one also does not have any zippers on the arms. So if you don't like that, it'd be perfect because it would be nice to, um, if you lean your arms, you wanna wear it during the day because sometimes I leave my jacket on when it starts to get cold, I'll wear them at my desk. I like them for a more business look because you could dress this up. Um, sitting for those virtual meetings, this would be a great jacket for that. Um, and then you won't, if you're resting your arms to type, you don't have those zippers in the way. So this is very comfortable. Has the little button or a buckle detail here on the side. I think it makes for a really nice silhouette. I like this pretty, pretty blush color. Here's a closer look. It's a little long in the sleeves, you can see for me, so I would need to scrunch them up or cuff them. And you can see the cuff inside has this um, kind of pretty pattern with the blues and the white. So that's what that would look like if I cuffed it. And with the black dress, kind of pulls it all together. So here's what that would look like. So one side cuffed, one side not. All right, so the Tommy Hilfiger Women's Moto Jacket and Camel. This is only $59.99. This is cute for someone who has a jacket fetish and we're going into cold weather. This feels like you're wearing a nice cardigan. All right, and I have one more outfit for you. Okay, so last dress is by Daily Ritual. This one is called the women's super soft terry short 
sleeve crew neck tie front midi dress. That's a lot of words. Um, $32.90 for this dress. The Daily Ritual brand is always affordable. Um, at least every, every item I have seen so far. I tied mine off to the side. They had it tied in the front. It just tends to be my preference. I always like everything off to the side for some reason when it comes to a tie. I don't like things right at my stomach. I always feel like when you're off, when you are standing with someone looking at you on the side, it adds bulk right to your stomach. Um, so this hits me right below my knee. This is very soft, very comfortable, does have a crew neck. And it, it is a great, a great dress. I like it. I'm not loving this light gray on me when it's my entire body. Um, so I might actually look to see if this dress comes in other colors because I do like it. So here's what it looks like. There's no slits or anything on it. Here's a closer look. And then the last item I have for you is this um, blazer. This blazer is really cool. It's called uh, Lucy Whims the Drop. And wait till you see how cute this is. I'm hoping that it fits me. I love a good blazer. And I always love a blazer with a surprise. Um, so this one has a little bit of a poof sleeve to it. Comes in this, I just want to call this like a blue gray. Um, but it has a fun surprise in the back. So what do you think of the cutout? I like it. I think that is so super fun, unexpected. It does have front pockets. I like it over top of especially this light gray because it breaks it up for me a little bit. Um, but I think this is a fun blazer. Here's a closer look. I'm worried about these poofy sleeves on me a little bit. I feel like it might be adding some extra bulk to my shoulders <laughs> and making my head appear a little tinier. Um, but that's me. But I do love this back. That's so fun. Okay, and this one is called the Drop Women's Charcoal Cutout Black back cutout back blazer um, by Lucy Wims, 7767. And that's all my items. I think I did, I just wanna make sure I'm clear. I'm pretty sure you can get eight items sent to you for try on. I only have seven today, cause that's what I picked. Um, you don't have to pick the full number of eight. Um, you can pick up to eight. I think you just have to make sure you pick at least one um, to have sent to you. I picked seven this time, cause that's what I liked. All right, um, they do offer up alternate suggestions. Whenever your stylist picks your pieces for you, um, you do get to preview them. You can pick different colors if they're available or different patterns if they're available. They will have alternate suggestions. Sometimes you can add, um, which is a lot of fun and you can kind of play around with it. So I had fun with this collection. I love the kind of fall dresses and jackets, pairings, and I, um, I'm trying to figure out what I would keep. I will list all of these items down below for you in case you want to check any of them out on Amazon. I'm feeling like, and I usually, before I check out, I will note this as well. I check if I'm going to keep something, for instance, um, if I want to keep this blazer, I will check the pricing on Amazon because I feel like pricing changes all the time. So I would just check it before I kept it in my um, prime wardrobe in case it's cheaper if I just buy it directly from Amazon. Um, Sometimes it is cheaper in the box, sometimes it isn't. So I would just double check that. And that's it. Okay, so my favorites. I have to figure out what I'm thinking about this blazer. So I love the back. I'm not necessarily loving these shoulders on me. So, yikes. Not sure about that. I am loving this jacket for the price. I thought this was amazing. This is a really nice weight. Um, the price was great. The color is so pretty. It's so comfortable. So I'm thinking I want to keep this. I really liked this dress. I thought it was fabulous. Um, so I'm actually thinking I might want to keep this dress. And then I actually am thinking about this one. This was just a fun plain black knit that you could dress up or dress down. Um, so I'm actually thinking about this one as well. The 
This was, this was an awesome idea, but it's just way too stiff for me. I really liked this one as well, but I think I own something similar, so I don't need this one. And I actually think for this dress, I think it's super pretty and I like it. I might see, especially for the price of $32, I might see if they have a different color because I'm not really liking the light gray on me. And I think that's everything. All right, thanks so much for spending time with me today. I so appreciate it. Hope you liked it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Would love you to hang out, hit that subscribe. I will list everything down below, as I said, in case you want to check it out. Share your favorites, what stood out to you down below. Reading your comments is the very favorite part of doing these videos. Till next time, everybody. Bye-bye.